stayed at home. You know, summertime always makes us feel nostalgic for those good old days of camp. Yes. Well, today we're throwing it back and making patches made of felt. Let's get camping. Craft crafting. It's hot out there. We want to keep things easy. We're going to be starting by uh, drawing out our images on a piece of cardstock to create a template for our patches. Yeah. All right, campers, our first wilderness patch is done. We're going to yes. keep it a nature wilderness theme. Yeah, and a good tip is to keep your design simple and use objects around your house just to make all the lines nice and clean. Yes, now we're going to cut these out and use it as a template. Don't worry too much if your pieces aren't looking perfect. I mean, this is a camp craft. It's supposed to have a bit of, you know, wonky, you know. <laughs> busted, busted feel, yes. And before I move things around, I'm just gonna number this so I can keep things in order. And these pieces here are going to be the green backing, so I don't even have to worry about those. All right, now here's where the magic happens. We're going to be using iron-on adhesive. We are going to iron on a piece of the double-sided iron-on adhesive to one of the back pieces, because it'll be easier to cut out the individual pieces rather than having to do them all separately. So the yellow here I'm gonna use for my sun. I have this on a low setting. It, it bonds relatively quickly. Now, if you don't have and like an adhesive. Don't worry, you could sew it on or you could use craft glue. And then for my rays of the sun here, I'm going to use a light orange. I like it, it looks retro, 70s camp. And you just iron that right on. Cut. It looks great. Cut. It looks yeah. really great. If you need to, you can make adjustments as needed. Trim what you have to. Uh, now we're going to peel the back and start ironing it together. The patch looks great as is, but we want it to pop a little more. So we're just going to add a piece of felt to the back. And we're just going to do that by adding a piece of adhesive to the back of the patch the same way we did to the other pieces. Yes. And then if you want a removable patch, what you can do instead of using the iron on adhesive, you can add a little pin backing. Yeah. It looks so cute and it's on really well. I do want rounded edges here. So I'm just going to cut these down so I have rounded edges. A tip for rounding edges is move the felt instead of the scissors. That will just help you get a cleaner edge. Looks great. And then this one we decided we want to use as a removable patch. We don't want it to be permanent because it just looks so cute. Yeah, so for this we're gonna be using a pin backing and you could totally sew it on, but we're gonna be using a piece of felt that has adhesive on it already. We're gonna cut it to size so it can slide through the pin backing just like that. And then we're just gonna iron both sides down. I love a no sew project. You know that about me. Yes. <laughs> but of course, I mean, sewing patches is so classic, but I think this works totally well. And it's great if you have kids, maybe you don't want them to use the iron, but it's a lot more hands-on if they can do everything but using the iron. And it's a lot easier than sewing. Although if you have kids, teach them how to sew because I still don't <laughs> know how to sew and I would love to. Dennis, teach me how to sew. Nah, bruh. <laughs> So cute. No, so cute. No, so cute. Oh, throwing that joke back in. We just finished putting together our second patch and we did it the same way we did our first patch. Super easy. Yes, and the best thing about this is that we're just giving you the basics here yep. and you can embellish as you want. Totally. We're actually gonna add some star details using a little bit of embroidery thread. Well, he is, because I don't sew. He makes me do all the work. Yes. We got the sun and the morning and the moon at night. Good morning, star shine. Yes, the, the camp sun medley. Yes, it could go on and on. <laughs> We had a lot of fun making this. It was just nice to relax, you know, and just have a good time. Throw it back to simpler times. Yes. We want to hear if you're getting crafty for summer, let us know in a comment below. And we hope we inspired you to take out some trail mix and just get creative. Give us Don't a like, like, subscribe, and we'll, and we'll see, see you soon. Bye-bye, campers. Bye.